Looks like small little tunas, I hope. That'd be cool. Boy, it's nice and calm. Oh yeah, they're jumping pretty good. What are those things? They look like small skipjacks or blackfin tuna. They're jumping straight out of the water. Could be mackerels. All right, see if they want to bite. Come on. Oh yeah, oh he hit it. Come on, come back. I think those might be mackerels. <clears throat> oh, he hit it again, come on. Eat it. Oh, I'm, I'm in your way. It's all right, I'll go around you. Oh, hit it again. Tough to hook. There we go, I'm on. Woo! Oh, he pulled me right around. Sweet, this is cool. First Costa Rica kayak fish. Woo! Oh! Where was it? I still got them. Those guys should grab kayaks, this is great. What is that? Nice big mackerel. I mean, I can. Oh, look at that. I could give them away. Yeah, I'll give them away. Look at that. Sweet. Woohoo! Nice work. Thank you. Lots of fun. Oh my god. Really? Like right behind you? Oh yeah. Well, you'll just have to do it again. I'm up a bunch of bait. Cool. Keep on. Yeah. Well, you got two nice ones so far. I know. There we go. I'll have a good chance here. I can't believe how calm it is. A bunch of jumping down there. Oh, look at him. He rolled right on it. Should have a good chance of hooking one right now. Come on. Nice work. I feel like I should go get those guys. Another nice little Spanish mackerel. These guys are great eating. Little epoxy jigs are working really well. And they're just uh, all over the place. So the kayaks really come in helpful today. But boy, is it hot out here. <laughs> you getting a good tan, Lauren? 
Oh yeah. So we'll uh, keep these guys. They're gonna be great eating. And uh, what a what a perfect day! Holy cow! I wouldn't want to be stuck out here for more than a couple hours though, because it is hot. One hour. One hour. <laughs> but it is nice and calm. Yeah. And so much life out here. Yeah, keep that rolling. Maybe I can get enough. Yep, it's hot. There we go. Oh, he came off. On again, off again, on again. I got, oh my God, he came off again. Another hit. There we go. Boy, they're tough to hook. Yeah, there's a bunch of them below us. Woo! Oh, a nice one. Oh my gosh. This guy was hooked well. Oh yeah. Yeah, they're all over the place. Oh, another hit, another hit. Come on. Good fishing. I think I'll go in and at least tell those guys. All right. All right, you can tell them I've gotten uh, five mackerels. <sighs> On again. Boy, it's like every cast right now. Oh, this is great. Everyone's got to be eating well tonight. I know a lot of you folks are mostly catch and release, which is fine, but there's no shortage of mackerel in the world. And fish is pretty much the number one source of protein down here for sure. So folks actually get upset when they hear I'm releasing fish. And uh, there's no shortage of these mackerel and they are delicious. And you hook them so poorly that most of them aren't gonna live anyways. This guy's got his gill. So, I have a nice haul of mackerel to share with everyone. Whew! What a cool trip. Man, oh man. These mackerel are a ton of fun. Plus, you never know what else you gotta see once you get out here. It is so calm. I can't imagine being shipwrecked in the Pacific. It is just so calm and hot. But here's the, uh, the pull for today. Really nice Spanish Max or Sierra mackerel. I don't know the difference, but these guys will be delicious.
So I've got these floats on the rod just in case I drop it overboard. Figure that would be a smart, smart idea. Whoa! Another nice one. Every cast. bigger some big schools just showed up I think I might have something a little different on the line here maybe some kind of little tuna oh yeah wow there's some big feeds going on I think this is definitely some kind of tuna there we go Hold on, buddy. Whew. Yeah. Little black fin tuna. Woo! Oh man, what a nice fight on this gear. This is awesome. Look at this guy. Nice. Sweet. Look at that. That is awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Whew. Sweet little tuna. I gotta try to eat these guys. We'll keep one of them. Oh, here we go again. Nice school right here. Whoa, what a nice school. Oh yeah, I'm on. Man, these guys fight great. This is a bigger one. Probably maybe one and a half, two miles offshore. came off no way Jeez. the other tuna is going nuts got a big school of blackfin tuna in front of us wow what a nice school These guys aren't huge, but they fight really good on a light little spinning rod. My God, look at all of them. I'd say I have a pretty good chance of hooking one. Oh yeah. What a school. Must be a small one. Now he's pulling. Look at that school. Nice, it's a little guy.
Just gotta do a release on this one. See if I can get another one. Wow, just as the school stopped. Look at that, they just all of a sudden went down. I picked this guy up just at the last second. <laughs> Getting pulled around pretty good by this one. Pretty much the same size, but he fought much better. Very cool. Boy, that's a nice surprise. Did not expect to be catching these guys in the kayak today. Long cast, I think I'll reach him. Yeah, I'm right in him. They're so aggressive too. A lot of the fish this Costa Rica trip have been really picky and tough to fool. But these little tunas are very easy to fool, at least as of right now. That guy came off. Yeah, let me bring us over to him. My golly, look at that feed. Oh, it just went down. Hopefully there's still one around to eat this. Come on. Oh, there we go. Just using a little white Mighty Fish epoxy jig. Man, this guy fights good. Jeez. I can't believe how hard these guys fight for their size. And look at that rod tip. <laughs> Another sweet fish. Some more jumping off the bow. On again. I think he's coming right at me. Yeah, he's swimming right at the kayak. God, these guys are nuts.
Hey, check out this bird. What is it? Look at him. <laughs> oh, he wants it. Oh, man, I can't believe. I'm going out under those birds. Those are roosters in Dorado out there. They got to be. Good. Look at this. Here you go, bud. You think you can swallow him? Did you? Yeah. It'll be worth it. Wow. Yeah, apparently they don't want the popper. They're literally swimming right around my kayak. Wow, we got huge rooster fish and enormous jacks that just showed up. Believe it or not, I just hooked up with a Dorado and he went flying airborne four or five times and I ended up dropping him. I've got the wrong rod for these guys. I only got my, my little pole right here. I need much heavier tackle. I'm running out of uh, battery on the camera. We've had some huge huge rooster fish explosions on the surface and they were just swimming right around my kayak saw about 20 of them swimming right around the kayak lots of frigate birds i'm going to be it's got to be a real challenge for me to hook a rooster fish or a big jack on this rod. Oh, hit! I'm on! I'm on! It's a giant! Oh my god! You've got to be kidding me! He hasn't taken off yet. He doesn't really know he's hooked. Wow, what a hit! I got a huge school of roosters below me, I think. I think those are all roosters. Wow, look at all of them! They're all behind me, John. This is insane. Look at these fish. They're all around me. They're all roosters. I've got 50 of them right around the kayak. Wow. I cannot believe this is happening. I hope you can see these rooster fish. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to turn the camera off because I'm running so low on battery, but look at these roosters. Oh, what a beautiful sight. Been looking for you guys for weeks. Wow. <laughs> Got my hands full with this small little reel. Uh oh. I'm doing all right, but he's, he's just now starting to run. Nope. I thought it was a rooster fish, but it's a huge jack. That's the biggest jack I've ever caught. Wow. Dude, that guy is huge. Holy cow. At least. Oh my God, and he inhaled that popper. <laughs> yeah, he did. Wow. I thought it was a rooster. We had giant rooster fish cruising all around the kayak, but I'm not gonna complain. That's the biggest jack of my life. Wow. Inhaled it. That is a serious jack. Oh, they're so strong. 